Well, when I left school, I went to work for the Turnbulls at Kirk Newton on the farm within the dairy and had milked the cows. We had quite a few cows, I think it would be about 30. I delivered all the milk with the pony and trap. And the first pony that we had was cheesecakes, but we didn't have it very long because it, it was a bit on the small side, you know, and that and for the distance we had to travel. We travelled from, uh, well, I, I did Old Yevering, I think, and Old Kirk Newton and West Newton and delivered at Hethpool and that. And then Mr. Turnbull went away and he bought Prince up from Newcastle. And that was my favourite. <laughs> this was when I was taking the, and they had the bull going with the cows. And it was going up from Kirk Newton up to the, the bridge just below West Newton. I used to walk in front of them and Pony was left with the trap and coming in behind on his own. And this day I happened to be sitting in the pony trap and the bull was there and he just turned and he charged and he hit him right on the chest and knocked him down and sp split his, his yeah. chest. And I had Fly the collie with us and by a bit of luck she realised what was wrong and she, she literally leapt out and she stuck her teeth into the top of his tail and hung on. She was up off, off the ground on all four legs. And he went up through that herd of cattle. <laughs> and, that. and if it hadn't been for that dog, I don't know what would have happened. So they had to get the vet at the dog and the horse and, and had stitched, but he was all right. There was nothing broken. With being on the farm, I had to pack in because I had no days off. I worked every Saturday, Sunday and every day, so I left and went to the Glendale store and uh, I used to go out into the, the countryside and collect grocery orders and every farmhouse was full. <laughs>